What is expected goals? In a lot of ways, expected goals, or XG, is a simple stat like passes completed, tackles made, or shots on target. It's the shot count that we naturally tend to look to for a gauge of who we think deserve to win, but not all attempts on goal are equal. XG ranks their quality, giving each a probability of being scored. For example, here's Jack Grealish about to take an audacious effort from long range. What are you doing Jack? You've only got a 3% chance of scoring from there. Wow. We expect an average player to score that Jack Grealish goal about 3% of the time, so the XG value for the shot is 0.03. Chances are ranked between 0.01 and 0.99, from highly unlikely to ever score to highly unlikely to ever miss. For example, here's Britta Sombolonga bearing down on goal. We give him a 55% chance of scoring from here, an XG value of 0.55. Our model suggests he should score more than half the time. Okay, never mind. Adding these XG values up for every attempt on goal in a game gives you a total for a team. Our model uses a huge amount of data to work out how often we would expect a certain attempt on goal to end up in the back of the net. Shot location is one of the major data points when calculating how likely it is that a goal is scored. It's not rocket science, is it? You have a better chance of scoring from inside the six yard box than from the halfway line. While sometimes it works, less than 1% of the time, as well as shot location, other factors play a part in determining the XG value too, including how many bodies were in the way, whether it was a set piece, Was it a header or a shot? Was it a volley or an attempt with their weaker foot? These all play a role in calculating an XG value. By looking at a team's expected goals numbers versus their actual goals, it's possible to identify those teams who are profiting from an unsustainable, lucky hot streak or a team that has been on an unfortunate, unsustainable cold streak. Expected goals also allows you to examine which players are most clinical and which are most wasteful. XG is a helpful tool to predict the future performance of teams or players. For example, Reading missed out on promotion to the Premier League by the narrowest of margins in 2016-17, losing to Huddersfield on penalties in the Skybet Championship playoff final. They finished third in the table, but ranked 20th in the league based on XG. XG models were expecting the Royals to have a poor 2017-18 campaign unless there were drastic changes made to the way they were playing. That didn't happen. So it was no shock to anyone at InfoGoal when the data caught with Reading that following campaign. Where did they finish? You guessed it, 20th. Even that was lucky though, they ought to have been relegated based on XG. Want to learn more about how InfoGoal uses our unique expected goals model to drive betting tips and analysis? Head to our education tab within the blog page to find out more.